the operations we do, which are bandings, sleeve gastrectomy, gastric bypass, and the duodenal switch. So let's, uh, I'm going to have to go through those with you. Banding okay. is what? Is where we place an artificial plastic band essentially around the upper part of the stomach. So and it what does that do? It just use. decreases the size of the stomach that the food goes into. Yes. That's banding. Right. Then you said a sleeve. What's a sleeve? That's where you resect about 70 to 80 percent of the stomach and you make the stomach physically smaller so it can't hold as much. So it, um, instead of just resecting part of the stomach, why don't you put something in there that makes a wall where you can't see that other part of the stomach? Well, we've had surgeries that were kind of like that, the old vertical banded gastroplasty. They didn't work any better than the bandings do now and they weren't adjustable, but... Um, Once you take off part of that stomach, two thirds of the stomach and throw it away, you, you can't ever get it back, is that right? No, that's irreversible. That's irreversible. Yes. And so you've got some problems there with how you digest food, how much volume of food. So let's go to the next one. That's a sleeve. What was the next one? The gastric bypass. Uh huh. And the gastric bypass, that yes. means, means you bypass the stomach. Yes, exactly. So how do you do that? What do you do? Well, we divide the very top part of the stomach and then we divide the intestines lower. We bring the lower part up and hook it up to the pouch and then rehook the two ends down below. So you just bypass. So the food goes around the stomach just like 640 goes around Knoxville. Okay, and then the fourth kind was? Is the biliary pancreatic diversion with duodenal switch. Now those are awfully long words. Yes. And we were talking about that type of surgery earlier. That's for the people that are really tremendously overweight. Yes. So are any of those surgeries more difficult than others? Uh, I would say they go, they increase in difficulty in the order that we talked about them band easiest, then sleeve, then bypass, then duodenal switch is most difficult. Is it easy to look at a person, to take their history, to see what their body mass index is, see what your goals are, and select number one, number two, number three, or number four? Well, I, th I really think it is, because the, the weight loss and the results with these operations is fairly predictable. And so when I'm looking at a patient's health problems, body mass index, and what they desire, it's easy to marry up the correct operation with them usually.